Mm-hmm. We are losing too many people who are dying for becoming paralyzed. And families are suffering. Mm. So what should we do? What should we do? Why do we hit? We should. What, what what do we do? That's the issue. You know, uh, so many Ugandans have asked me inbox and then I see even uh, other people's posts, uh, people putting the blame on Bobby Wine. Uh, that uh, is the one causing the death of these young men. I refuse to get into that trap and uh, I want also you not to get into that trap. When governments that are the dictators, let me first take you to the history of the world. Hitler killed the people. Do you know who chased him? The people, power. The people of Germany got tired of him and got rid of him. Mussolini, but not Mussolini in Italy. The same thing when the king gave him power to become a prime minister. Do you know what happened to him? to Mussolini later, people chased him when he collapsed the economy. The Italians stood up. Mussolini is no more and Italy is still going more. I can name several dictators including the, the, the Napoleons, do you know what chased them? The King, the King Louis is of France, the guy who owned like the whole city, almost the whole Paris. The current Paris today, the capital city of France, it was owned by one family, one man. Where is he? He killed the people. King Leopard, he killed not less than six uh, million Africans and other Belgians, other Europeans. Where is he? He cannot kill all Ugandans, Mr. Museven and his army, and they know that. This is just a tactic to intimidate Ugandans to make them feel like no, uh, back off, these things are meant for soldiers. For But this is politics. See? Politics is about making policies, not about making wars, you understand? Now, Mr. Museven is always at war with who? With the people of Uganda. He, the name of his party is called National Resistance Movement. What are they resisting up to today? Even when you look at the thumb you, you raise, we go and do it. Like, what does it mean? The real meaning of this? It's not good. So you want Ugandans to surrender uh, to him and say, okay, rule us until you get tired. That is becoming foolish in the country. No Ugandans, no single Ugandan. Who chose to be born in Uganda? Right? They all found themselves Ugandans. They did not choose. Some seven did he choose to be born where he was born? And after all, even people are skeptical about his origin. You understand? But that is not the case. For me, I think Bobby Wine should not quit and uh, uh, I, I also have one thing uh, to him, he should not even blame himself. Everyone who is dying, hmm, he has died his own death. Each one of us will die their own death. And has we strive to be better, right? So, some people's death will be caused the struggle. The other day they shot a woman and she was just carrying plates. She was not in struggle. Today there are other 19 women who have died in hospitals. Just, you know, they are crying. He's giving birth. Boban is not campaigning there, isn't it? Hmm? There are many Ugandans who have gotten different types of accidents. By what? Poor road policies. Because we, are, we have a government of people who, are, who only know one thing, fight, 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 fight. Even when they, they cannot see anyone to fight, they rather fight their own shadows. So you, you, you want to say that uh, uh, Ugandans leave their country to search people for more time. Actually, m my message to Ugandans and the people, uh, the person of Bobby Wine, is just to increase. 
whether they kill him or not, he will die, right? He's not the first person. We, we, all of us who are born, we have to die. People were born in nineteen uh, in nineteen eighties and uh, eighteen. They, they are no more. No one who is still living and was born in in eighteen eighties. Let be even someone who was born in nineteen zero zero. They are no more. So why are we afraid of seeing people die? He will get justice. Actually, the more energy uh, people put in to push him seven. Hmm? to push him out the quicker they will find justice but when you choose to quit so you're delaying even the, your own justice we've seen the cases of ICC who seven is exonerated you know why he's exonerated not because uh, ICC does not see the, what he has done you understand they see what he has done, they see the crimes, but since he's the president, is he immune? Because they want also to cooperate with him, of course, they, want to be, they call their paralysis, prosecution paralysis. You understand? All these things will be nullified if he's out of that seat. That is the only way. So, the, the more Bobby Wine and his team push, hmm, the quicker Museven will serve will swallow the mess he has created. That is in my own view. Bobby One should not quit.